the Northeast India is blessed with its unique and diverse culture and hence we have a host of people from various walks of life that have contributed to the region. They are our icons, cultural, social or sports the region has people to look up to. And not only are they idolized by people from Northeast India, but the entire country. The list is, of course, long and ever-growing. But the chosen five of the contemporary icons from among them. Bayachang Bushia For a cricket-crazy nation, Bayachang Bushia must have something magical in him to have made so many fans across the nation. The once captain of the Indian football team, the Sikhimese sniper has been dubbed by several Indian football veterans as God's gift to Indian football. Winner of the Arjuna Award and the Padma Shri, Bushia is a role model for many young and aspiring footballers of the country. Unlike many politically correct sportspersons, Bushia fearlessly refused to carry the Olympic torch to show support for the Tibetan independence movement. Bushia was criticized but remained firm about his decision. The All India Football Federation AFE has recently roped in Bushia as an advisor. Shillong Chamber Choir Founded by Padma Shri Awardee Neil Nankanar in 2001, Shillong Chamber Choir shot to fame when they won the popular show India's Got Talent. They have performed in Canada and the US, Europe, South Korea and in West Asia and Southeast Asia. They have also performed before the US President Barack Obama and a host of other prestigious events. Their renditions and performances on Bollywood songs have been lauded everywhere. Music being an integral part of the Northeastern India, Shillong Chamber Choir is an inspiration to many. Papon Angarag Mohanta, also known as Papon is a singer and composer from Assam. He has not only added is the melody to popular music, he has also made his way into the hearts of fans. Papon has not only performed in Assamese and Hindi but also in Punjabi, Marathi, Nepali, Urdu, Tamil and Bangla. He stresses on the fact that Indian music is much larger than just Bollywood. Apart from lending his voice to popular Bollywood movies, Papon also received critical acclaim for his work in Coke studio at MTV. Papon has confessed to having faced racial discrimination in the national capital and has emerged a winner. Ayaram Sharmila Ayaram Chanyu Sharmila has been on a hunger strike for 15 years. Now 42-year-old, Ayaram started has been protesting since November 2000 for repeal of the Armed Forces, Special Powers, Act, UFSPA. This started after the death of 10 Manipuris who were shot dead by the Assam Rifles in Amphil. Over the years Sharmila has been arrested, released and again arrested on the charges of attempt to commit suicide. Under Section 309 of the IPC is the maximum term is one year in jail. She has been force-fed through her nose in jail. Last year Manipur court has said, her hunger strike, was a political demand through lawful means and had ordered her release. It is to be noted that she was released earlier this year, in June, and was re-arrested immediately. When Sharmila started her fast all those years back, some had called her mad. Some also said her boyfriend was amongst those that were killed by Assam Rifles men. Even though AFSPA has been lifted from certain parts of Manipur, parts are still under it. And with the rise in the number of rebel groups in the state indicates AFSPA will not go away soon. However, one woman and her resilience remain firm. She inspires us to even challenge the system if needed. Maricom If someone the women are dainty beings, one should have a look at MC Marikam. Loving known as Magnificent Mary, Meng Chung Najing is a famous boxer from Manipur. Not only is she a five-time world amateur boxing champion, she is also the only woman boxer to have won a medal in each of the six world boxing championships. The mother of three kids has a host of achievements to her credit including gold at Asian Women's Championship a bronze each at 2010 Asian Games and 2012 Summer Olympics. She also added gold in the 2014 Asian Games. Even though she has been lying low for a year with a shoulder injury and settled for a bronze medal at the International Boxing Association's AIBA, Olympic Test Event in Rio de Janeiro, Mary continues to inspire sportspersons and women in general. 
With modest means Mary's struggle started from an early age and would have to cycle for kilometers to reach for her training in Amphil. Winner of the Arjuna Award, Padma Shri, Padma Bhushan and Kalratna among others, Kam has been affected by terrorism personally. Her father-in-law was shot by unidentified gunmen in 2006. But Mary refused to crumble and continued to win laurels for the country. Thanks for watching. Like, share, comment. And don't forget to subscribe.